What the hell? Live dangerously. <laughs> Greatest. I am the goat. Come on. Come on. You all saw that. That was just... That was just too good. Okay, so uh, we got turd head here and uh, old uh, Smokey McGee. Oh, damn. Is he in the bathroom? Okay. Very close. What the heck? Okay. Happy fun land. All right, all right. This game I was super excited for. And yeah, love it. Looks good. Hands are a little wonky, but hey, what are you gonna do? Maybe this is save points here. I'm not sure what this is. All right, let's get this game going. I'm excited. Well, yeah, cause I haven't, okay, there we go. Hey kids, it's Fort Grizzly's Happy Funland. Oh my. Uh, motion sickness, huh? Alfred, don't get in my way. This is your warning right here, Alfred. You see this sign? I, I know you can't. Just look at the computer. Look, I'll look at it. Look at the computer. See? Beware of your surrounding. You get in my way and you're getting punched. All right. To the west. Is danger land, okay. a land of perilous danger. You Somebody. and your whole family will enjoy a happy and fun escape from your sad and futile life. And more Love the aesthetics of this so far. Really cool. Now Florida's happiest and funnest theme park. Whoa. Okay. Paper physics, huh? And it's uh, hey, click. Hey, kids. It's Fort Grizzly's happy fun land. Okay, that's that's more of a. Happy Funland is laid out at the four star directions of the compass to the north. Yeah, I don't think it should do that. Filled with enough winds even to kill any child's fancy. To the east is Western Land, land of the outlaws. Oh, jeez. To the south is Anytown Plaza, USA. Alright, the controls. An authentic recreation of turn of the century themed retail. Okay. To the west is Dangerland, a land of perilous danger. You and your whole family will enjoy a happy oh, and cool. safe for your cool. sad and futile life at more busy Happy Fudland. South Florida's happiest and funnest theme park. Bye. See you guys. <laughs> if you had never heard of Happy Fudland theme park, or its tragic tale. Nice. You agreed to meet a total stranger and Larry in the middle of a South Florida swamp. Perhaps if you had known about the grisly events that happened there, you wouldn't have agreed to the job. Wait, what? <laughs> Freaking Randy wrote it. Alright, alright. Hey! Hey, dude! What's up, bro? You hear me, Larry? Watch me! Come on out here to the dock and we get started! <sighs> hey, Alfred, I think I found the box. Nope. Can't open it. So... These controls are really I weird. Dude, dude. I call everyone dude. Jets, dudes, whatever. Yep, so I'm Larry. Thanks for answering my ad. Look, I know it's real hard to find someone willing to be some random crazy stranger out in the middle of the yeah. swamp night and all like this. So I do appreciate the gun. F your trash can. Randy. Or Larry. Whatever the hell your name is. I already forgot. Well, now, look at you. Yeah. You'll do just fine. <laughs> so, the first thing we need to do here is have you strap this wireless video camera on top of your head. Okay. This here will allow me to see, hear, and record everything you do. I can talk at you on the headphones. I'll fill you in on more aggressive plane as we go. Here, put this on. Alright, got a signal. Video looks pretty dark, though. 
You know, when I told you to meet me here at night, I kind of forgot about the whole lit being dark thing and all. So, you're probably going to want to have a flashlight. There's one in my toolbox on that crate over there, my fence near my truck. Why don't you go over there and get it? Alright. So, okay. It's, yes. Can I have a drink? No, if you're a drink. Alright, so there is no smooth turning. Anyways, it being dark and all just helps set the proper mood and such. Plus, it just seemed to be easier for sneaking in. Cover of darkness and all. Okay. Flashlight's just in the red toolbox right there. And I can't move any quicker. Oh, it's so slow. That should come in handy for you. <laughs> Alfred, I found your mom's toy. Boy! Well, there it goes. If she wants it, it's on the other side of the fence. Okay. Yep, yeah, it's over there, Alfred. Get it. Um, yeah, so there is a few things. <laughs> I mean, the graphics well, are cool. Anyways, like I said in my ad, I needed someone to explore and videotape this abandoned theme park I found out here called Happy Fun Lane. Okay. You ever heard of it? Probably not. It was no. closed and abandoned in the early 70s. See, I make online videos where I explore abandoned places and things, and I yeah. usually would just do it myself, right. but I came out here last month to do just that, but I didn't make it too far till boom! Damn gator chop off both my legs. Oh yeah. yeah, you better believe it's been hell. I <laughs> thought my video graphic days were over. Yeah. My video channel would start losing followers. But this here find is way too big to walk away from, even if I could still walk. Yeah. So that's where I came up with this idea for just having a wireless video headset and all and just hiring someone else like you with legs to explore the place for me. Okay. So come on, hop on the boat, we can get started. I mean, the graphics, I I'm digging the graphics. I think you did a great job. Um, but yeah, there are some, uh, some jankiness to it for sure. So this here dock was the closest point of entry I could find out of here, just outside of Dunkin' and Property. They got this whole place locked down pretty good with the next five fences and all. If they still got power, there must still be power going to this park. And I happen to know a fat way. Now don't you worry about being the tech for gators out here or nothing. As long as you're careful and keep an eye on them, you should be just fine. Just don't be stupid like I was and you should be able to walk away from this on your own too late. So now we're crossing on the Grizzly Company property and are technically illegally trespassing and all, but don't you even worry about that. Pretty sure they don't even control this place that much anymore. I am having a hard... There's another billboard for the park. Park Grizzly, Happy Funland, home of Randy Road. You ever heard anything about Port Grizzly or Randy Road? Or about that terrible tragedy that closed this whole place down? Just like flying rats. Yeah. Woods, we'll see you guys over in Bootstrap is. later. But yeah, this guy does talk a lot, and it's. There's it's a, the old entrance to the parking lot. Okay. That used to be the main way in, but you can't even access that road to the freeway no more. Road's gone all over ground. After that tragedy, the company just pulled out and shut the whole park down. Oh, wow. And they supposedly tore it all down, too, but really, it all looks like they just tried to bury the whole thing out of here in the swamp and left it to rot. Oh. Hey, is that? No, that's, the, that's not the one that took my legs. Who's fault? I, I swear that's the one that got Chubbs Peterson. It got Chubbs eye. All right. I swear Almost there was a scar on that alligator's eye. There it is. Your entry way to the fun park. Oh, come on. Just follow that storm drain all the way down, and it'll lead you right to the main electrical room. All where right. you can hopefully get the power back on for the whole park. I admit it ain't the most sanitary next to where you're in, but it'll do you. Oh, and we can discuss your payment after you get all the footage you need. Fair enough. Once you get that pile restored, you should be able to explore the whole place. Right on right. surprise and stuff. You like fun parts, right? So this should be fun. You should consider the fun you'll have here as part of your compensation. One of the perks of the job, if you will. 
Sure. We're gone now. Get to it. I ain't got all night. Jeez. Dang skaters. All right. Now that's definitely some freaky freak. I'll probably just the wind. Look at this. Now I'm not even set. Okay. Anyways, yeah. this thing park you're breaking into here was built by a guy named Morris Grizzly. Well, I don't mean built like installing the frame and doing the drywall or nothing like that. No, he was a big money. He wasn't no, no animator or nothing like that Walt Disney fella. No, Fort Grizzly made his fortunes of firearms, <laughs> alcohol, and tobacco products. Randy Rodent was a Grizzly Tobacco Company's cartoon cigarette pitch man. You know, to hook the kids. Mm -hmm. Anyways, I read up on him and all, and I guess he was facing a bunch of government law. Hey, what's that? Some kind of Randy Rodent crime or something? This stuff weren't here the last time I looked. No, I did. What's oh. that note say? Destroy random road figures? I guess you should probably do that too then. Okay. I mean, is that all I came down here for? Okay, that's it. Oh, Mother Jesus, oh. Mary, Joseph, and Eileen. Where the hell did that thing come from? Damn, they're so in my drawer. About sport my best trousers. What is that? Some kind of crazy Randy Roden headed mannequin? I swear I didn't put it there, dude. I mean, sure, it's true there's been lots and lots of people that have died here and all. And yes, there are rumors this place is haunted and whatnot, but don't that can't that feel very me. good. Just that keep can't going, feel very dude. Good. Don't check it out on me now. Oh, yeah. Whoa! Wait. Wait a second. Oh, that looks even oh that looks creepy i'm feeling oh that see now that is scary that like m looks like a giant mouth opened up i agree with the the other uh guys that said um it, it, it just doesn't seem scary what the hell i want to put that mask on let me see it Goodness, a stupid. See, I don't know what. Okay, the controls are broke. Oh, I'm, gonna, I'm gonna admit that. Can I grab it? Nah, I guess I can't. All right. Anyways, can't go that way. All right. What the hell? Oh. All right. Okay. So I guess I gotta go this way. No, nope, can't go this way. Oh, that's just scary. What? Oh my goodness! Okay, that's more scary than the actual game. <laughs> All right. Wait a second. I'm so confused at this point. Did I? So this is about as far as I got the last time I tried breaking in here. I was a tunneling into the electrical room up there when that now damn game came up what? behind me and chopped mm. off both my damn legs. <sighs> well, mm. I beat him off, me and all. Had to crawl myself back to my boat, losing half my blood along the way and all. It was pretty brutal. But this is where I find my Randy hat, though, so it weren't a total loss. Okay, some of those... So, we gotta get this running, right? The power goes out, put fuse in fuse box, pull lever. Okay. Well. Where's the old fuse, huh? Right, we got some poison there. So, uh, this is Ed, had a maintenance. A lot of people coming to me with questions all the time, same questions over and over. Quick <laughs> of answering them, so I'm gonna make these tapes. So if the power goes out in the pot, you can't get the power back on basically because usually because of the fuel. So you gotta replace the fuse. Uh -huh. That is usually a fuse in the cabinet. You just put that fuse in the fuse box, pull the lever and start the power back. <laughs> Have to come to me with the problem. So you got a brain, you can figure it out. Listen to the tape. Okay. There we go. 
Nice, nice, nice. All right, power on. Door mysteriously opens. Okay. Yeah, I don't like this uh, snap turning. This is a real bad snap turning here. Okay. Anyways. Hey, I think I lost communications there with you for a bit. Good job taking some initiative and getting that power back on and all. Looks like you're just about to the front entrance of the park now. Should okay. be just up ahead. Goddamn bats. There's a half the fun man, son. Another one of them weird ass balloons. Hot damn! Watch out for that sucker. Don't get up on him. Just let him pass. I like how they. Keep your legs on. Just let him pass. There's one of them old timey photo booths over there, too. Maybe you can save your memories of a nice little adventure in any one of them booths. All right, you're at the Happy Fun Man main entrance. <laughs> Hard to believe this is all still standing out here and all, huh? This is really going to help me out with my game. I, I mean, my followers. Help me get more followers for my video game. See, I had a lot of time to learn up on this place while my legs was healing. They say they had this whole place almost completely automated. There are a few actual human employees. Mostly robots or audio automatons, they call their slaves. I guess they were very advanced for the time period and all, built by some Nazi German scientists or something. Apparently they all went all up to the haywire one day and just up and killed everyone in the park and all. <laughs> that was a tragedy part I told you about. Okay. Another one, another one. Let's say 80 of those. Okay. Honey, it's clean. Looks like you're gonna need a ticket to get in. Poke around back at one of those ticket booths. Maybe you can buy one there. I already see, so now I'm starting to see what the other guys are complaining about. Um see, that should have opened up earlier. Ticket dispatched. All right, you got a ticket. Go give it to that auto automato, that Tommy and Tone Tiny Tay, Tiny Tim thing at the front gate. Hell, you know what I'm talking about, that thing with wires. Thank you. This ticket is valid. Have a fun and happy time at Fort Gregory's Happy Fun Land. You are not creepy at all. So take your head off. Okay. All right, you're in. Fort Gregory's Happy Fun Land. Never thought I'd see this. Hey, looks like there's a map over there. Go check it out. I really wish this guy... <laughs> that's what everybody else said, so... I'm taking back what I said about the other guys. Uh, the other YouTubers. They did say this guy does talk way too much, and he does. Alright. So, we are somewhere here. We got a lot of lands. Fancy land. Danger land. Western land and something there that's missing. Okay, another one. Yep. All right, dude. You got a map and a mini golf scorecard. Okay. Oi. Oh, nice, nice. Okay. All right. Okay. So that was a issue of the. Okay. So now I. <laughs> Anyways, I, I switched the snap turning to a little bit better, but okay. Let's see what we got here. You might want to hold on to that putter. Could make a decent weapon if you might need one. Okay. Yeah. All right. So putt. I played some, uh, I'm pretty good at, um, Oh my goodness, what's the other mini golf I play on my channel? Yeah, they got this whole area all blurred out on the googly area. Really? That this is looks not like empty swamp land on there. Can't see any of all this what's here. So I guess they were originally going to call this place Grizzly Land. After more Grizzly and all, which would have been more appropriate after all the Grizzly murders they had here, don't you think? Oi. Uh, not sure why they would have the doors tied into the mini golf, but whatever. Well, I got a par three anyways. What? Well, yeah. Okay. Yeah, this is a pretty weird game, but <laughs> I do like the aesthetics of it and wish that guy would not talk as much. That's all I'm going to say. I think he's ruining the feel, and that's what the other uh, YouTubers said as well. So I agree with him on that. I agree. Well, let's get further into well, the game. Yeah. Looks like you're trapped in there now. Well, don't get all freaky freaky on me. 
everything's still going according to plan. We're just switching to plan B, and I'm going to figure out what that is. So for you, that means just keep exploring the whole place. I got the recorder running, so the video should be perfectly fine. Just keep it going, and don't be scared at all. It'll just be like a walk in the park for you. Mm-hmm. Sure. Yeah, the physics are, are broke. That's for sure. Wing, 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 wing. All right. Definitely broke physics. All right. Hey! Ah, uh, dang it. Well, looks like you're trapped in the gift shop now. Well, don't just stand around lying gagging. Look around for a way to get those security gates open again. I don't want to be out here all night. Ah, <laughs> cool shirt, though. Boy! Can the can, can the can. Ooh, pretty cool, pretty cool. Gotta break all those suckers. Wait. I mean, it's, I mean, that is kind of fun. I ain't gonna lie. Damn, ran a road of merchandise. It would probably have been worth some money online, though. Oh, yeah, no kidding, huh? Oi! Anything hiding around here? What the hell? Come on, man. Come on, give me a second. Anything over here? No. What is that noise? Oh. Oh, dang it, I hate those Where do you go? Probably best you just destroy him then. Damn. No, that ain't him. Oh, that's cool. Alright, alright. Can I use the sword? Hell yeah. That's how you do it. Anything over here? Ah, yes. Oh. There we go. There I think go. you did it. Good to see you ain't as incompetent as I first took you for. Don't worry, I'm still getting rid Whoa, there he is. Mort Grizzly statue. Jeez. I can see the resemblance. I mean, sure, he killed a lot of people with his products and all. Firearms, alcohol, tobacco, <laughs> theme parks. But overall, not a bad looking man. I imagine he brought a lot of people a lot of happiness with this park. Well, except maybe the ones that died here and all, but you know what I'm saying. You know, there's a rumor he's cryogenically frozen here somewhere mm. in the park. He has a very familiar look, almost like one of my enemies in the DC world. Mm. Can you think of who I'm talking about? Okay. Let's go. I mean, God, I love the aspect of the game. Or aspect, what, the design. 4D, huh? Sights, sounds, smells, spikes. Uh, wonder what they mean by spikes. Ooh, that's blinding. Oh, yeah, by the way, this game is mature. Let me just tell you. Who knows what we're going to see, but uh, it is a very mature game. So if you're... Not old enough. Get off my channel. One man's greed, huh? I like the way he thinks. Mm -hmm. Hey, what's that button on the wall there, dude? Born Grizzly was a true American original. Born Mortimer Abaddon Grizzly, June 6, 1906. He became known to children the world over as simply Uncle Morty. But he was also known as the Fat Man. Not <laughs> just as an accurate description of his physical appearance, but from the acronym it's a, F -A it's like an Alfred Hitchcock Alfred style going on Chicago, right there. From Prince Grizzly built his fortune. Money, money. All right. Whew, look at all this fancy stuff. Take your time looking around at all this stuff in here. We might learn something interesting. Okay. Got 
they start in 1920 as entrepreneurial young lad. Providing wow. affordable homemade alcohol to those who crave it during a time we commonly refer to in the U.S. as prohibition. Bad, Bad baby. Bad baby. drink were pressed from the start. Smoking that early. Mark, he was a millionaire. So, the reason I'm not going faster, because I heard once the audio sequences start, you can't stop them. So, if I start this and that's going, you're going to hear three things. So, that is also, to me, a broken... Never wanted to let laws or morals stand in the way of profit, the Grizzly Firearms Company made many lucrative contracts in the war profiteering Firearms, alcohol, to oh. to blossom into what President Dwight D. Eisenhower warned us of the military industrial complex <laughs> the company has grown into today. See, that should have been breakable. All right. Oh, man, this is a cool looking statue. It's fixing untapped potential in the lucrative youth market. The Grizzly Ad Company created the character Randy Rogan in 1929 to more effectively market the product to school children. Randy Rogan was hailed as the first cartoon animated synchronized sound anthropomorphic profit figuring cartoon pitch man and was an instant success. The 1950s brought more fortune to Grizzly. By now, Randy Rodent was a household name, and all of Grizzly's businesses were moving in the post-war economy. Mort's first and only son, Mort Jr., was born, and whom Mort considered a disappointment from day one. In Cold, 1959, huh? Mort had a daughter named Petunia, who was the apple of his eye. Colts. I don't mess with Colts. That's a freaky dude right there. What do we got going on? Grizzly land. Oh, it's supposed to be Grizzly land, huh? Actual cocktail nap sketch of the Grizzly, Mort Grizzly drew in 1964. The 1960s were turbulent times for America and for Mort Grizzly as well. Many lawsuits were brought against Mort and the Grizzly companies by state and federal governments. During a meeting with the heads of the New York families in 1964, which happened to be at the New York World's Fair, Mort had an epiphany while riding a boat ride filled with animated dogs wow. with his daughter. He realized he had enough cheap swamp land to build a family fun. Construction was quick and resulted in many workers' deaths, but the entire park was designed and built within the year. Under the supervision of German scientist Dr. Hans von Sturman, whose genius in robotics made the robots in the park... Princess Lanier. That is too cool. I don't know why that freaked me out. Six, oh, that's... What's up, bro? Oi! Oh, oh, come on. on. You better hurry and find a way out of here. You'll we'll be killed by this back. Look around for the in there. Some way to get that door open before you get crushed by this back. Hurry up now. I ain't got another one that's going to hit you. That hit you worth a lot more than I was playing on those tables than I do. Because you better get damaged. You see. <laughs> great job shaking the video headset and you're your life and all, but that's great footage you're sending. Hey, is that mouse trap I see there on the floor? You might want to be careful with toes around those. Oh my goodness, yeah. Yeah. Unfortunately, the day before the park opened in 1965, Mort's daughter tragically died in a freak got killed the accident Mort. That left Mort haunted for the rest of his life. He began to work extensively to extend the work for sure. Dance. Dance, monkey, dance. Okay. There is so much going on, audio-wise. It's killing it. It's killing the game. I agree. I agree with everybody. It's not that. Kill. 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 Did you not cross this line? Yeah, yeah. Holy 
shit, dude, I seen it all. Damn, a tummy of times are alive. Holy oh. shit. <laughs> Maybe the going power too far weren't the best idea I ever had. Probably brought those guys back to life, maybe. Well, too late now. We need a plan three. Hmm. Uh, hang on a second. One of my girlies calling. Oh, my. Hey, did you get it? It's good? Oh, you know I won't, so. Yeah, just hang on to it. I'll be right over. <laughs> uh, did you eat yet? You want to? Oh, this excitement out here has made me real hungry. First, I'm going back to the dock and go get me some food or something, because I'm really starving right now and need to go get something to eat. But once I do, I'll come back out here again and scout out another way in or something, and hopefully you'll still be alive and all, and you'll just meet me there. All right? All right. Good luck. There's a burger place I know of close by, so it shouldn't take me too long. Anyways, I got the recorder running, so the video should be perfectly fine. <laughs> You just keep going and exploring the park and all, and I'll be back for you real sure. soon. And don't let my headset get broke. Ten four then. Hurry oh out for now. Goodness. Get out of here, mice. All right. Okay. Good. Shut the hell up. Oh my goodness. All right. I'm putting with the damn sword. See how good I am. No way. I'm the greatest. I am the goat. Come on. Come on. You all saw that. That was just. That was just too good. Okay, so what happened though? Oh, okay. There we go. There we go. There we go. There we go. All right. Let's hit up. I mean, it's a cool. God, the whole thing's cool. They just, they did ruin it. It's not scary. I mean, a little quick, you know, things like that. But it's not. It's not scary. Scary. Just get in the photo booth, save it. There we go. Blind me again. Hey, this is Ed, head of maintenance. Making one of these tapes again. <laughs> Got a lot of new hires, a lot of new kids coming in here, dumb as shit. Dumb in a box of rocks. Tell them one thing, they can't keep it in the head. So we lock the castle gates every night. If you open in the park in the morning, you're gonna have to open the gate. There's a lever, each side of the dust bolt, on, close. Pull the lever, clean out the pipes. You know, if you load in there from the night before, you clean that out. <laughs> so don't be uh, surprised when it shoots and blows. Alright. Oh, shit. Okay, that was scary. I was not expecting it. Yeah, so, so, yeah, that's a horrible fight. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, lock your mustache, bro. Some of the physics are pretty hilarious. Oh, no, come on. We got, uh, we got Turd Head here and, uh, old, uh, Smokey McGee. I mean, these are not scary, that's for sure. They're gonna count that, but I really don't care. Maybe I should have kept a putter around. There we go. Hey, oi! Oh, 
It's got uh, real Terrence and Phillip vibes going on from South Park. <laughs> Boy. Damn. I hate to fix that wiring for sure on that one. Jeez. Alright, be very gentle. <laughs> you son of a bitch. You son of a bitch. Go back, go back. Oh my goodness. I don't think it actually, uh, matters. Yeah, didn't think so. Yeah. Oh! That guy. My scorecard. Oh, that's horrible. That's a horrible score. Jeez. Okay, new land here. This is gonna be very difficult. from the music. God, it's so loud. Oh, I have to go in here to get a little... You must be at least this tall to ride me. <laughs> Finally. God, turn that crap off. That was annoying. Alright. Yeah, I feel like they ruined this game. It's such a cool game. Why did they do what they did? <sighs> so disappointed. I hope they do a bunch of updates and I'll come back and play it for sure. But I will finish it. I'm not going to not finish it. I do want to finish the game. Give it its due diligence. Okay, watch our putter right there too. Nutty. 
That's on the. Oh, just put me in. Okay. <laughs> oh, he hit the back. Right. Oh. Get you a nut! <laughs> oh my goodness, the place is falling apart. I'm head out into the city and find me a nut. Again with a nut. I'm gonna rob the liquor store. I'm gonna rob the liquor wait, store. Wait, the liquor store. Stop that squirrel. They shoplifting from my store. <laughs> hey, stop! Up <laughs> your old pig. Ain't never gonna find me in here. Oh I'm just gonna my. Make a quick detour through the club. Hey, we can have fun. You want to buy some drugs? No, I'm good, bro. Yeah, I'll take everything. Oi, you come back, sir. Ooh, look at all the drugs. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my goodness. Ooh, we are flying high now. Oh, Please, my. hippie, you're going down. Ooh, we buzz kill. You did. <laughs> Asylum for the criminal. Oh, my Don't goodness. Hippie. This oh, is a wait, trip. I saw it was one nutty squirrel. <laughs> yeah, kids, stay off the really hard drugs. Oh my goodness. Okay. Okay. That was kinda kinda neat. Little fun. Oh damn. Is he in the bathroom? Okay. What the heck? What do you got in here? Bl blow your own. <laughs> Alright, where am I going? Holy. What the heck? What the hell? Wow. Are you kidding? What really? What the fuck? What is happening? Oh, 
sir. Come on, come here, come here. Get him, get him, get him. was a trip let me tell you oh my literally wow 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 oh we got some boats maybe some pirates the old caribbean going on caribbean okay i'm supposed to get on here maybe i gotta get on yep find a save booth and I'm gonna pause for the day that's just okay that one made me actually god dang it I gotta find out. trying to find another save point get out of here oh no come on so I think that's the best way just let them come at you one at a time I think they're limited to how far they- Oh no, there they go. There we go. I think it's what, four or five hits each? Come on. Okay. There's gotta be a save thing around here somewhere. Hopefully I didn't miss it. I need to save. That, okay. Okay, we'll explore this later. Yeah, I gotta take a break from this game. <laughs> oh, nice. But uh, that uh, spinning around the air right there, that, that got me. Motion sickness. So, and I am pretty good at my VR legs. But, uh, yeah, we're gonna pause for now. I will pick it this game back up. Not sure if I'm gonna get this video out today or tomorrow. We'll see. But, yeah, happy fun land. I'm gonna have to agree so far, but I will finish it. It's a little bit janky, unpolished, needs a lot of work, but man, this could have been such a good game. I don't know, maybe it'll get better as we go. But until next time, never stop gaming. VR Night out. <laughs>